Hello everyone and welcome back to Clinical Cousins YouTube channel where today we're going to be talking about Promaxin which is imipenem and Silistatin. It is classified as a carbapenem antibiotic and it is given for gram positive, negative, and pseudomonas infections. Think anaerobic bacteria. It cannot be given if your patient has a penicillin sensitivity and use caution because it can cause super infections. Now, in pregnancy, it is thought to be relatively safe, but what we need to know is that imipenem will bind to our penicillin binding proteins to prevent the synthesis of the bacterial cell wall. However, we have a problem. Imipenem is usually metabolized and rendered inactive by dihydropeptidase 1. It is an enzyme in the kidneys that tears apart imipenem. This is why we give the drug silistatin, because silistatin prevents this enzyme from metabolizing imipenem. Therefore, imipenem can do its job and have a more efficient outcome and longer half-life. We should know that the half-life of this drug is about an hour and we should be sure to watch out for the side effects of GI upset and venous injection site irritation. Now, some commonly tested material about this drug is that it is given to treat gram-positive, gram-negative, and pseudomotus infections, and celestatin prolongs the effectiveness of imipenem by occupying our dihydropeptidase 1 enzyme. As always, thank you for taking the time to learn with us today, and remember to like and subscribe for more content.